The International Boxing Federation will allow Lamont Peterson to keep his junior welterweight title despite failing a drugs test and has ordered him to fight Zab Judah in a mandatory title defence. The IBF said Friday that an independent physician examined Peterson's medical records and determined the testosterone levels were consistent with the therapeutic use of the hormone and not for the purpose of performance enhancement. And Peterson is keen to insist that he's never cheated. Never in my life. This goes beyond boxing, fighting for money, things of that nature. This goes to, back to you know, nine, ten years old playing a checkerboard game. <laughs> You can leave out the room, whatever. I'm not going to cheat because if I cheat, I didn't win. And I love to win. The DC native won the first fight against Khan by a split decision. And Khan in his camp later filed a formal complaint, with several boxing authorities contesting the two points deducted from Khan during the championship bout. That complaint was ultimately dropped and both champion and challenger agreed to a rematch. But ultimately that fight was cancelled, much to the annoyance of Peterson. They probably, you know, at that point, if had I been with a big promoter, I'm sure that I would have fought May 19th because, at the, you know, my, 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 my urine was clean. They would have just, you know, said that maybe it was a mistake or they deal with it after the, you know, fight because at this point, I'm not on, the, on any enhancement or anything like that. The fight, I, I, I truly believe the fight would have went on. And um, the fact that, you know, we are, you know, independent, and, um, you know, I'm not under any big promotion company. You know, this, sometimes this is just some of the things you have to deal with. Peterson's mandatory title defence against Judah will apparently take place as soon as possible on a date that all parties involved agree upon.